So, in an effort to be transparent, <coughs> transparency. I don't want them to think I'm slandering these people. What I find interesting is my title was issued on the 22nd. I suppose, uh, Uh, about it Friday, so probably I don't know when. By looking at the calendar, but I had possession of the car before this was so uh, it's anyhow. What was the mileage? Ninety three, ninety three. The mileage that I bought it at. So, this is story time. So, I went in, got the tires on a Saturday. I power technology here. Uh, so, the mileage in was 96.55, 7.18. This was the day I got the tires. This was also the same day that I had him give me an estimate for the check engine light. Because I thought, like them, it just needed a tune up, but I didn't say that's what I wanted. I just wanted an estimate to go down to the dealer for. So I bought the car, put new tires on it because they were a bowl of shit. And got a uh, alignment. That was six hundred some dollars. Something like that. I got that cut off. And here is the estimate because it was the same trip. Of course, I didn't have it done. 96.51 for the check engine light. And they were going to do a tune up to the car. They didn't really look at it. That's just, you know, whatever. That estimate was $800 there. So, anyhow. If I went ahead with this, I would still have a non-working car because that wasn't the problem originally. That's not against National Tire Battery because they just didn't really, you know, diagnose it like I wanted to. But the reason why I bring this up is mileage, the date that I brought it in. Okay, showing that I had a problem in the car. So, I think at this point, it's when I called originally, set up employment, and it took them like two weeks for me to even get in there. So, I'm just driving to work. I think I drove uh, to our terminal twice. <clears throat> so, by the time he gets in the shop, The mileage was 98.62. And what day was this in? 8.5. And this is when they looked at the car. Tech inspected scan needs at least upper engine camshaft related work. $5,500. They, they told me. 67, I guess with taxes, whatever. Cylinder is inoperable. And, of course, I said, well, it would be cheaper just to swap the motor out. Oh, they don't want to open.
bring it over here. Whole engine, 75 for just that. I mind you, I just bought the car. So this 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 car had a problem since day one. Well, that's my proof that I've had problems since day one. So <clears throat> all right. I have to exchange that tool. So this is a tally of what I've spent so far. Seven nine. I got tools included with this. So seven dollars and ninety nine cents for an oil pump, hand pump. Thirty seven four for a harmonic balance tool to pull the balancer off. The Torx bit. I'm sorry, actually, that's the uh, harmonic balancer installer kit. I haven't even used it yet. $37 just to put the balancer back on. I got uh, $27.99 for a Torx bit socket set. These were just missing sockets, so I'm not going to count those. Uh, harmonic balancer puller, $38.99. Sure you got a digital torque wrench, 8731. Stool and a creeper, $60. So that was the tools, and then we get into parts. 1366 for thermostat. Head bolts, $23.99 for a set of two. Timing chain. Uh, that's, I had to buy a whole kit. 87.15. See, lifters. 429.99. Camshaft. 303.38. Head gasket. 104.99. New oil pump, 78, uh, 73. And, uh, you know what? I'm just going to throw in the goddamn door switch. 2488 for the windows. Driver's side control panel. Fuck it. So, uh, there's anything else here. Alright. That's not counting the tires. <laughs> I guess I'm going to switch your. Uh, oh no, yeah, I didn't, I didn't count the uh, that switch. I'm not just count the switch because I didn't look at the car. So, you know what? We're, we're, we're going to add the tires. Fuck it. I didn't look at the goddamn car. Clearly, didn't look at the car. So, that was 600 plus. Uh, I think I paid. Uh, I think I paid like 120 for the diagnostic. So I'll be generous with a 110 on that. Plus the extra 1,050 they tacked on the car. The car was originally eight. So, oh, oh yeah, I forgot. I almost forgot that. Yeah. I guess we'll do this on the fly here. I didn't think of uh, uh where is that from? Well, you know what I can just add it. This is a regular post or picture on here. Advertised price. So reevaluate whatever you do there. We're sworn. I uh, 
set. Yeah. I'm looking through my lawyer's emails. I sent a bunch of invoice photos. I don't know. See, now I look at the $3,000. Because Rachel is not going to sue him. I said, screw it, I'm going to waste my money. But now when I look at that number, after I just crunched the numbers, maybe I will <laughs> hit back the goddamn lawyers again. It's fucking bullshit. I like how these people sleep at night. Well, just saying. Yeah. Uh, where I'm at. You know what? Probably pull up on my phone. What are we doing? I put it on my phone. Yeah, screw it. I'll just I can always post a picture of it. I'm not saying. Anyhow. Yeah. Three thousand dollars. So this car has cost me just under twelve thousand dollars. I could have bought a complete fucking car. So yeah, that's without interest. Without interest in the bank. And we even got license plates on it. This is a 9, 912. I haven't got license plates on it. Cars in my garage right now. The you know, only thing I can do right now uh, is uh, kind of, you know, periodically uh, sit here and drink my coffee and. Mire, mire my high performance piece of machinery from the comfort of my computer room. So, yeah. Apparently, I gotta dust my security cameras off. Anyhow, have a good day.